Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm going to share with you guys the center I'm going to be rocking for the night. This is called New York Rye. And this is coming off the distillery series from Walmart. And this is basically uh, a clone version of Cree Aventus. Uh, and these I ain't seen them at Walmart no more. So that's why I'm trying to get in some wearings. I don't know if they took them out of there or whatever the case might be. But uh, this thing smells good, man. I ain't show you guys the spray. Pretty decent spray. Not bad. Pretty cool baller. Now, these ballers is more like collectibles piece, in my opinion. Uh, this is something you want to keep in your arsenal. Even when the juice is gone, you're going to want to keep these ballers around just for memories of how cool that ballers can get even on cheaper grade colognes. And you be like, hmm, cheap cologne could come out with a baller that cool, you know? So I bought that back in what, 2000 and what, 2019? 2020 or whatever. I think I got these when it was last year. I think it was last year when I got these balls, like around the end of 219, something like that. Not sure. But uh, yeah, man, these are pretty cool. Um, the notes is right on the box. This here is the New York Rye. Let's just tell you the notes on the box is leather, pineapple, and pepper. And pretty much it's a copy of Creed Aventus. Uh, if you like Creed Aventus, then you'll like this one. Peppery, pineapple, leather. You know, that's what you get here. Um, this one here, when I spray this on, I get about an hour and a half to maybe two hours of projection out of this one, which is not bad because it's only like $10 at Walmart at the time of purchase. So pretty much, I still got a lot left in my ball, as you can see. Let's see here. Yeah, I got a lot of juice left in there still. So I can get, got close to, got over half a bottle somewhere up in here. Like up in there maybe. Yeah, so I can get some wearings on this thing before I, so I hope I can still get this. And this, to me, this was the best one, in my opinion, coming from the distillery series. Um, If you guys just bought this one and then buy none of the rest of them, in my opinion, this is the best one. Out of all four of the distillery series, I think it's New York Rye, which is just my favorite one. I think it's um, I think it's um, Alabama Moonshine or something like that. Tennessee Whiskey and Kentucky Bourbon, I think that's what it was. Anyway, I have all four of them. But in my opinion, this is the best one. The one that smells like Creed Aventus right here is the best one out of all of them. To me, if you just got this one right here, you you good. Uh, to me, it's the best one. Um, it's better than all of them. Yeah, it's me. That's keeping it real. Um, like I said, I get about an hour and a half to two hours of projection. With this longevity, it's somewhere between... I said, I get about four to six hours of longevity. It's pretty long lasting. Especially if you take this and just dice it on your clothes. Like, just go around that collar area of your clothes like this. It pretty much lasts. I always hit right around here on my shirt because I know the smell of your clothes. And then the heat will radiate around your neck. And the smell that's coming off your clothes and your neck is going to prolong the smell. So that's another little tip. And your vital points is around here and stuff too. That's where you generate a lot of heat around your neck area and stuff. So, And that's why I always put it around the collar part of my shirt so you can smell it all the time. But yeah, four to six hours, not bad. Considering this is um, a cheaper fragrance, it's the one I got out of Walmart. And I like the design of it, where it's got like the leather wrap going around here. It's got like a wooden top and stuff around here, around the cap. It's really not real wood. It's like plastic, but it's got like a wood look covering. This is probably vinyl wrap. It's not true leather, but it represents leather. And in the state of New York, it's carved up in there, as you can see. State of New York. So it's pretty cool. Bottom. It's a. I would say it's a good collectibles piece because never know if you'll find anything else like this. Uh, this kind of take you back like a time capsule. When you bought this, you look back at these videos and stuff and say, whoa, I remember that cologne. Ten years from now, you better look back and say, whoa, I remember when I bought that cologne out of Walmart. You know, so 
Yeah, these bottles are a good collectibles piece. Like, if you guys still can see these in your Walmart, I would just grab them, man. Even though the fragrances are real, they are good as well. But the presentation, the bottle alone is pretty cool, man. Like I said, it just take you back three, four, five years from now. It just take you back, give you good memories about when you bought these colognes and where you got them out of Walmart, how much you paid for them, and all that stuff. It'll, it'll just kind of carry you back, and you'll remember. So, oh yeah, I got that out of Walmart. It was a really good cologne. And like I said, this to me, this was the my favorite one, the best one out of all of them, in my opinion, was the New York Rye, which is a Creed Adventures cologne. And to me, this was the best one. Better longevity, better projection. This was the best one to me. Now, the best time for this one, I would say this is a great date night scent. Very impressive, too, guys. The way it smells. I think that nice pineapple leather will really impress the ladies. Um, also, this will, if you're going to carry your wife on a dinner date or something, like I said, very impressive. This is good if you're rocking in an office with a nice shirt, tie, whatever, pair of jeans. This will work for any set. I think it's very versatile. I think you can even rock this one at the club. Yeah, this will go at a club. It's nice, pineapple, leathery. You can rock this at a club and um, get away with it. It's it's a bit a good all-around cologne, guys. If you never smelled it, give it a try. It's New York Rye. Basically, what it is, like I said, is a copy of Creed Adventures. Now, I ain't going to say they smell 100% of light, but that's what they're going after. All right, so anyway, I'm going to be rocking it for the night. And uh, I just want to bring this to you guys comment below if y'all still see these at y'all walmart i don't know mine i don't think i've seen them at none of the walmarts that i go in um they could be still there i'm just looking over them you know but anyway you guys comment if y'all see these at your walmart because i'm interested to in know is they still carrying these at walmart and um like I'm about to say is uh, I just don't know where you can really get these from if Walmart doesn't have them. I'm trying to figure it out now. Where could you get them? Because, like I said, this baller is a nice, good, old-fashioned collectibles piece if you can get them, you know. And uh, I think this will be a great scent for fall as well. Uh, as long as some of the other ones. That we have is a great scent for fall as well so you know smells super good and uh yeah guys i think y'all should give it a try if you can find it like i said i hadn't seen it at my walmart yet no more but you know it could be there it could be just sold out i don't know the case i'm pretty sure they still sold somewhere though uh, but where I don't know other than Walmart because Walmart's the only place I ever seen these, you know. So, y'all comment below what y'all think about these. Do y'all still see these at y'all Walmart? All right, hit that subscribe button, y'all. Till next time, I'm out of here. Peace.